say how Brittany and I met. Four years ago, um, we were playing in a softball tournament. Then she was also on a bachelorette party that night, and we ended up walking over to the bar, and her bachelorette party was there at the same time. I was on a bachelorette party when we met, and we had a list of things that we had to do. It was like a check-off list. They were going off their checklist on what certain things they had to get done for the bridal party and stuff like that, and, and I helped her with a few of those checklists and stuff like that. And, and one of them was like, ask some random person marriage advice in a bar. And I went up to Dylan and I asked him for marriage advice, which I can't say it out loud because it was very inappropriate. Kind of hit it off after that. I got her number and, and the rest is till now anyway. I did not think he was going to remember to text me the next day. I was like, there's no way you're going to remember this. And then the next day, like at nine o'clock that night, he's like, text me and said, hey, I remembered. <laughs> I feel like it's funny how four years ago, I met some random guy in a bar and now he's like my whole world. So I feel like people always ask you the question like, why do you love someone? And I feel like sometimes people will list like a hundred attributes or things about a person that they love. But when I think about Dylan and I's relationship, it's more about the way he makes me feel. And when I think about the way he makes me feel, I always said growing up, like, I wasn't going to be that girl. Like, I'm not going to be the girl that wants to spend all the time, like, all my time with someone. Like, I'm not going to be dependent on anyone. I'm going to be independent. And I feel like when I met Dylan, I was like, oh, shoot, this is happening. <laughs> and. He kind of made me realize like, oh, I thought I could be that girl because I had never met anyone that I loved. Like, I love him. What I love most about Brittany, probably her laugh is part of the main thing. Um, she doesn't like it, I make fun of her for that, but I think it's cute anyway. Um, she's always persistent on you know, doing things together and I love that about her. And then the way she loves our two pets along with Sully and Remy. Along well, with myself, and I know it's going to be with our kids, it's going to be the same. That's another reason that I feel like I know I, like Dylan was the one, because I had never really been excited. Like, I wanted kids, but I've never been, like, excited to have kids. And, like, thinking of the thought of having, like, a mini version of Dylan is, like, I'm so excited for that. That's going to be, like, it's, yeah, I look forward to that. The reason I knew he was the one was because when I was growing up, my parents had the most amazing relationship and they still are like madly in love. Now I understand why they've always been like that because I have Dylan and now I feel that way. So I'm probably most excited to see him and see how he responds. I feel like I'm really, really nervous right now and like there's so much going on, but as soon as I see him, I know that I'm gonna feel better. Like, and I'll probably cry, but it'll be happy. Probably, see, probably me standing up there and waiting for her to walk down the aisle. Um, 
I was thinking about this morning and stuff like that and finishing up my letter and stuff I was and so I don't know if I'm gonna get teary-eyed when she walks down or not but I guess we'll see but that's probably what I'm most excited about. I know clouds will bring the darkness to cool me down I'm just looking for someone to understand I, Dylan, take you, Brittany, for my lawful wife. I, Brittany, take you, Dylan, for my lawful husband, to have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, and in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do us part. May the blessing of God bless all of you who are gathered here today, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I may I introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Yeah, let's do something tonight. Oh,